Hey guys, welcome to another Feature Friday video. Uh, I'm going to show you the different Sunseeker floor plans that we have in stock now. We've got some great options no matter what your needs are. Uh, we're just briefly going to go into the inside of these coaches, look at the floor plans, see what you guys think. Let us know in the comments. <laughs> First one here, this is one of our bunk model floor plans. <clears throat> As you can see, uh, you've got a lot of living space up front, a pretty decent sized kitchen for a unit with bunks as well. Um, sleeping space up above, these bunk model Sunseeker floor plans are cool because they offer so much sleeping space. So if you're wanting to take the grandkids or something with you, both the, both the seating options turn into beds. You got the queen bed over top, and then you have two twin beds as bunk options as well. So lots of sleeping arrangement space here. Uh, get a quick shot of this bathroom as well. Nice size bathroom, corner neo angle shower. <clears throat> lots of countertop space and vanity space in there as well. And then in the back, you do have a slide back here. Uh, queen size bed, slide out on this wall, which allows you to have the nice large wardrobe uh, with the television and stuff back here as well. Totally private from all the other sleeping arrangements. So. If you have all the rowdy kids with you, you still get some privacy back there. The next model we're going to look at is also a bunk, but a little bit different arrangement. All right, this one is flipped around. <clears throat> I, I really like this floor plan a lot too, um, and I'm going to. The bunks are a little bit different here. You get the same seating arrangement in the front; it's flipped, but same couch, same dinette option, same overhead sleeping. Kitchen's a little bit broken up here, separated, but it gives you a nice uh, workspace here. Flip up counter. Uh, this is what's really cool about this one that the other one didn't have. You've got seat belts back here and a TV across from the couch. This bed flips up, so while you're traveling, you can have that out of the way, and this becomes riding area. So you can put the kids back here while you're traveling. They've got their own TV, which runs on 12 volt, so you can watch it when you're going down the road, play video games, whatever. Kind of gets them out of your hair um, and allows you to really relax back here uh, again big queen size bed slide out on the wardrobe again uh, so lots of storage space back here this one's got a big sliding door again for privacy so you can separate this whole area uh, and make it make it really secluded back here and uh, the bathroom's in there um, this one doesn't have the neo angle shower instead it's got a tub so if you've got smaller kids that travel with you that definitely comes in handy as well but if you just need to use it as a shower plenty of space in there for that too all right on to the next one the next one's a couples coach i think you'll like this one too all right this is one of our uh i, I guess you could say premium lines it's got the full body paint auto leveling all the fancy features on it collision avoidance system <clears throat> okay this one doesn't have the bunk so you get a ton more living space if you're looking for that without uh, you don't need all the sleeping space this one is like the big kitchen model so really large spread out countertop space here recessed hidden um, uh, trash can in there that you can actually access from the outside it's pretty cool uh, you don't have to take the trash out inside huge dinette both of these do turn into beds as well so you do get additional sleeping it just doesn't have the bunks on top of the additional convertible sleeping space so lots of seating here big living area uh, fridge pantry with the big slide out shelf pretty nice uh, you can fit a lot of stuff in there it doesn't take up a lot of space um, so this whole area right here let me show you how this door works this is pretty cool a lot of people are like how do I close off the shower this this door actually flips all the way open and magnetically latches so you can close off the whole bathroom from the rest of the camper got your shower here <clears throat> large shower uh, this one's not a tub so you don't have to step up into it as high and then in the back, again, queen size bed. Um, the bed on this one is on a slide that way, which still allows you to have the large um, storage space over here. Again, television in the bedroom. And you could close this off to have this whole space separated, or you can close the bedroom off from the bathroom uh, with a curtain door there as well. So really cool floor plan for a couples coach. Got one more to show you. The next one's uh, more of an economy sized unit, smaller, uh, but it gets fantastic gas mileage. Really great floor plan for a small coach. Let's check that one out last. All right, 
So the big difference between this one and the other ones we've looked at, this is a Sunseeker as well, but this one is on a Mercedes-Benz Sprinter chassis. It's a six-cylinder V6 diesel engine. Uh, it's, it's much easier to handle on the roads than the larger coaches, um, and it gets about double the gas mileage. So it's a, a pretty nice change there. Again, full body paint here also. <clears throat> What I love about this floor plan is even though it's a lot shorter than the other ones, it's really open. You have a full wall slide out that starts here and goes all the way back to the end of the bed. So this whole thing is slid out right now, giving you tons of floor plan space here. Again, multiple seating options because you do have the couch that turns into a bed. There's a pedestal table that goes here so you can use it for a dinette. Or both of these chairs in the front will swivel around. You've got another pedestal table so you can leave this as a couch, spin these around when you're parked and have a dining area up front. Uh, bed option up front as well, so you get some sleeping space there. Really nice size bed here. Uh, no corner beds. A lot of campers that are this small have like a corner bed that you have to crawl over each other to get in and out of. This one still has full walk around space, and then a shower and toilet here. <clears throat> Lots of countertop space in that bathroom as well. So there you go. You've seen all four of our Sunseeker floor plans and the advantages of each one of them. Uh, lots of different options for lots of different lifestyles. So thanks again for watching this video, guys. Have a great day.